coming the chairman of a ward of it. Look at government, honorable. And time will you watch here, Brian. Please welcome him by standing on it. Please stand up and give him the standing on it. Hello. As we are welcoming uh, the Wellington Brimo, the chairman of uh, 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 the Club, eh? we are Honorable Ahmed Mohamed is the Chancellor, the President, Secretary General of the Powerful Apex Body in Amor of the Government, King of Boys, um, Star. Today, I die. The previous person, then my own brother, too, uh, the former Aspa for Works, Mr. Adewale Okubaki, my own uh, as of uh, Super for Market and Revenue, uh, Norebu Umau, uh, the, the deputy speaking speaker, here yeah, are present, our own Honorable. Uh, and all the deputies here present, the good people of what see and beyond. We thank you for honoring our own counselor on this uh, event of the health. Uh, it worked for the people. Free uh, medical uh, program. These are the programs that we encourage in our local government so that we get to the doorstep of our people. We all know the challenges we are facing today as regards the economy. And activities always involve money. And the money we, are, we want to use to eat, we don't pray that we use to spend it on hospital, I mean, to, I mean buying drugs, taking infection. But the help of a program of this nature, it goes a long way to give us an enablement in order for us to save money and get our medical health care being taken care of. It's going to hand over the mosquito net to five people because it's already wanted somewhere else. So don't rush. All of you will get the, the, the net, the mosquito net. But I want us to be orderly. Imagine a friend of mine having this he slumps and dies because he has not been checking. If he has been checking regularly, someone would have given him an advice that, okay, do this and do that and do this. So we want to appreciate some of our sponsors. Check out Square.com, God's Power Specialist Clinic and Hospital and Maternity. Yeah, doctors and nurses are here. Uh, I am Tunde Ajayi, the secretary of the Apex Leaders of Amuodofi. This is the first kind of what we are expecting in World C. And um, in the first edition of the free healthcare program, medical program, organized by Honorable Ahmed Mohamed, is a welcome idea. He's plowing back what the government is giving to him, to the people. Making people to feel healthy, wanting them to enjoy their life. In fact, I really appreciate it, and that's why I have to come to have my health status to be given even the drugs if I have problem to solve it. Honestly, I commend those who are behind this success story of Honorable Ahmed Mohamed. The council of Wasi. I understand they are the Gospel Specialist Clinic Hospital and Maternity and Diamond Bank. Honestly, I support them and uh, I want to encourage them to continue to support Honorable Ahmed Mohammed. He is one councillor that he wants to really 
give back to the people what is being given in what see because you cannot give what you don't have he has gotten it and he's giving it back to the to the to the world i want to thank him very much bravo i want to thumb up for honorable ahmed mohammed god bless him thank you sir I want to thank Diamond Bank sincerely. I want to say it empirically that they have challenged us as the government. I want to thank them because uh, they show that they are community people. This is what they call community bank. And we are highly impressed for what you have done to us today. We don't know what you have done today, but I assure you that you have touched lives. This is a very good um, program that the, the local government is organizing. Health is very important and it's been organized on Workers' Day. And of course, Diamond Bank, we always partner with our customers and our community as part of our corporate social responsibility. And we're very proud to be part of this, um, to this occasion. And we hope the next one will even be a bigger, a bigger event. It's a very nice program put together by the local governments. And we're always glad to partner with them. Thank you. I want to thank the initiator of this program we for having the love of the people at heart and for coming up with a program of this nature that related to the health care of people. We know the challenges in our economy today and that we find it difficult to even spend money to take care of ourselves. And for somebody coming up with an initiative to give a free uh, medical uh, care to our people at no cost, it goes a long way. Today you will know your uh, your health status and you're able to address it accordingly this gives you to know your conditions in your body and how i mean best you can take care of yourself it will go a long way to assist us and allow the individual to live longer in life i am feisha kwaido honorable councillor representing ward b2 deputy leader of the house i actually came to support my friend my colleague honorable ahmed in his um, free health um, program it's a give back to the community and that's what all the councillors are doing too i had my own on friday too so he was there to support me so i have to be here to support him to encourage people that we are there to represent them and not actually also give back to the community very fantastic very fantastic you can see that a lot of people people in the community actually need health health is a priority because our health is our wealth so whenever they hear of this you see the turnout so that means that we have a lot of work to do in terms of health in our community the majority leader like this is arms a mode of local what government i'm here purposely because of the free medical test that is going on in uh, what a c what c duly represented by honorable ahmed ahmed uh, it's a very good program a very memorable one I'm impressed because of the turnout. That is to show how it is very important. I really appreciate Almighty God for being supporting me, be guiding me, being protecting me, being me, giving me true way to make sure I put impact to the human being in the environment. Because today is my happiest day that I can have opportunity to surrender myself, to put myself into the democracy of the Nigerians and entirely a world of the local government. I thank Almighty Allah for it. What gave you the idea? What gave you the the, what inspires you to come about this? Before I become a counselor, I normally tell people, how many people have you touched their life in positive way? How many people have you helped to make him be relevant in the environment? But when I now become a counselor as an honorable, I'm thinking, what can I do for my people that to take part, to make sure they are relevant? Some people are, are not aware, but they don't have money to go into the hospital. If I can do this thing, they will know they are satisfied of their body. They will know the step thing to do. That is why I decided to do this thing for community. Do we to continue? By God's grace, I will continue. A lot of programs are coming very soon again.
Oh, my God. 